swagging on you niggas like that, that rap. Feel me? Uh, fresh on the scene, I just let the swag talk. Watch I pull up in that foreign just to piss them off. What's up, guys? Elusive here, and I'm gonna teach you how to use my 2D motion tracks template. And inside this download, you'll get a raw file with these folders inside of it, and you get Corino MA and Corino dash one dot mp4. MA stands for Maya, which is a file type, so you don't have to worry about it. And if, once in After Effects, you just import the MA file. And by the way, this works for CS4 and CS5, so you don't use camera checkers, so this might be a little different. That's why I'm doing this tutorial. And afterwards, you just double click on the Corino MA and then also import the MP4. Put that on top, and it's just a clip with the nulls. And you just find a null where you want the text. So just click, click on each individual null, and you, and this will come up. And you see, here's a null right here. The null is right here. So if you want the text there, just press P on the null, copy the position, then make a text object. I'm trying to hurry up these so I'm not make it too long. So after you're in the position, press Ctrl V to copy it. Let me paste it, sorry. And then make it a 3D layer. And that's pretty much it. It's more than track now. You can move it. It doesn't have to be on this null object necessarily. You can actually move it around wherever you want. It can be all the way over here. Still motion tracked. It can be here or up here. Yeah, it doesn't matter where it is. It's still motion tracked. And if it, you see it on the first frame, first frame. Here is behind. It's behind the wall, but it doesn't appear to be behind the wall. It looks in front of the wall. All you need to do here is just get your pen tool. Full. 100% press H for hand tool and move it around so you can see better then mask this wall and then press M on the text object and invert it and make sure I'm on the first frame and then press M for mask guy. and then press keyframe go ahead 10 frames move it over keep on going every 10 frames or so I do 10 frames and then keep on moving press H and V to go back to the position and keep on moving it over each and every 10 frames It'll automatically create, create these keyframes. And we can go back to fit up to 100 because it's past the wall. And now, if it's text over here, you can do the same thing just mask this wall and keep on keyframing the mask path. But that's it. You can also motion track PNGs, like pictures of things. Maybe like you're doing an edit and you want a picture of, like, I don't know. Mega Man or something, I don't know. Just a 2D picture, you can put that on there, do the same process with the text, and it will be motion tracked. And just anything, basically, you can do 3D stroke if you have that plugin particular, I'm pretty sure it will work. But I don't know if you would want to still flare. I don't know, maybe you do. But that's it. Elusive out. Peace.